Hello there and welcome to the Card Grotto. Today I've got the new release from Clearly Passotti to share with you. All of these items will be available to purchase today. That is the 1st of May 2020 at 8pm British Summer Time. You can purchase them from the Clearly Passotti shop and also from Simon Says Stamp. And I apologise that last month I said they were available at Simon Says Stamp but there was actually a delay. But this month they have got them in time so that's great you will be able to purchase them from Simon Says Stamp. So as I usually do I'm going to share the new release with you and also the samples that I have made. So the first set here is the Peaceful Plushies set. This is a really beautiful set. So you have this kind of Japanese garden here with the bridge there in the water and the kind of two little island type things with the cherry blossom tree just really really beautiful got the pagoda there as well and then you've got all of these adorable foxes with their parasols and their cherry blossoms in their hair or their fur i should say and the one with the fan there just a really pretty set so the sentiments read hugs hope you have a blissful day hello keep calm and carry on just breathe zen foxy friend don't worry be happy and to my so you can mix and match all of those different sentiments together so this is the card that I made using that set. I kept it fairly simple in that I just did a very small amount of masking. So I stamped out the fox there with the parasol, masked her off and then stamped out the kind of landscape behind. Uh, obviously removed the mask so that it looks like the fox is standing on the island. Obviously in terms of perspective and sizing, it doesn't quite work, but I still think it makes a really pretty card. Um, I think most people that use this set um, for the teasers have done it so that the foxes are kind of in front and then the, the garden would be a background, which does make more sense, like I said, in terms of sizing. But I, I like it how it is. So I just coloured the sky kind of like a bit more of a night sky, coloured in the water there as well. The sentiment I stamped and heat embossed um, onto black cardstock and that's from the A Little Sentimental set. Next up is the flower plushy set, absolutely adorable set. So you've got the cute little animals here. You've got the chicks or the ducks or the roosters, however you want to call them. I think they would work fine for either kind of thing. And then you've got the cute little bears there and then also the sheep as well. There's a fence that you can add on as a background. The sentiments read, I'd pick you every time, XO, yay, big hugs, you're sweet, stop and smell the roses, April showers bring May flowers, I love you, sending sunshine and smiles your way, hi, hey, you're sweet, you are beautiful inside and out. So I think this is a really great set for all year round, but especially for spring, especially if you want to send some sunshine and things at the moment in this difficult time we're going through. So just just a really really adorable set and before I share my um, sample I just wanted to share this set here this is this seen it flowers set I didn't actually use it this month um, I would planned to and I unfortunately ran out of time but I wanted to share it with you because I think this particularly works really well with the flower plushie set so you have all of these kind of three kind of backgrounds already made for you and um, so you've got the roses there with the, the I think these could be bluebells or lily of the valley I just think they're really pretty and then there's the sunflowers there and also the tulips and the daffodils and then the sentiments read if friends were flowers I'd pick you every time friends are the flowers in the garden of life so just a really pretty set that like I said I think works really nicely with the other um, sets especially the flower plushies so this is the card that I made using the flower plushies set I stamped out the little chick there with the sunflower masked her off and then stamped out the fence in the background I did some Copic colouring for the bottom half and then used the cloudy day stencil and some distress ink to create the cloudy sky stamped out the sentiment there at the top and then I just cut that panel into kind of like a fishtail banner just thought it would be quite a nice sort of design for the card 
So next up is the Spilling Tea set, an absolutely adorable set as you can see. So you've got all of these cute critters with their tea or coffee cups. There's the penguin there, the little cat, the squirrel, the bear, the sloth, the puppy and the bunny. There is some stacking cups or mugs there, the little steam marks in the shape of a heart and then the spoon. The sentiments are EXO, have you heard, hi, let's, time, sip. Hug in a mug, you are terrific, party, thanks a latte, you're my cup of tea, you're a sweetie, let's get together and spill some tea, fancy a cuppa, a cup of tea solves everything, so you can mix and match all of those different sentiments together. And I just think this is a really great set to send to friends or relatives at the moment to sort of say that you're missing them and you hope that you can get together for a cup of tea or coffee soon. I think that would just be a really cute card. And I did actually end up making two cards using this set just because they're absolutely adorable, the cute little critters. And I couldn't decide between the sloth or the penguin, so I used them both. I cut out two tags from the tag along die set, and then I used the freshly cut stencil, um, the kind of landscape uh, portion of the stencil, masked off the bottom of the tag there and did some ink blending above with distress inks. I did that simply onto a card base. There is some scored lines. These are really difficult, unfortunately, to see on camera scored lines, but they are there and I think they just add, you can just about see them there. I think they just add a nice sort of detail onto clean and simple cards like these. Obviously stamped out the sentiments there and stamped out the cute little critters, colored those in with Copic markers and fussy cut them out. Next up is the spring corner set. So you've got these beautiful corner images here with the little chicks again, or the ducks or the roosters. And then there is a separate one here in the middle, just the cute little one there with the daffodil as well. The sentiments read, new baby, special delivery, cutie pie, welcome little one, little cutie, baby boy, just hatched, XO, yay, hi, huge congratulations, a new bouncing bundle of joy, baby girl, chirp, and two kisses. Obviously, the sentiments are for kind of new baby cards, but I definitely think you could use these images all year round, especially great for spring and Easter and things like that, but obviously new baby, but I just think there's such cute images. You could send that as kind of like a hi or a hug or anything like that to people as well and so this is the card that I made using that set I just used the little one on its own with the daffodil there the cute little chick colored that with Copic markers and fussy cut that out I thought I would create a little circle card for this card and what I did was I scored that um, kind of scalloped circle there at the top and I did that onto the back one or the front one I should say so that it kind of folds as like a hinge I that's my preferred way of making shaped cards personally and I just like I said thought it'd be a cute little card just to send the little hugs to someone that sentiment there is from the flower plushie set and just used some pattern paper there for the background and then last but not least is the Piggy Plushy Plans set. <laughs> Say that three times quickly. Just absolutely adorable. Obviously, I personally love pigs, so I absolutely adore this set. But it really is just very cute. So you've got all of these different piggies here doing their different things, like one with the gym, or you could have that one with the football as well, playing football, which is really cute one with the pencil and then there's a pot of pencils there as well one with the hat and the cupcake there for a birthday one with the heart just really very cute you've got an extra present there like I said the football the suitcase there and the pencils and the sentiments read oink oink we hugs happy happy birthday to you sending you hugs and kisses thanks so much celebrate and missing you pig time just adorable and this is the card that I made using that set, kept it very simple, just did some uh, kind of masked off the bottom, did some ink blending in the background there and stamped out the sentiment. And then for the little piggy, I just stamped out the piggy with the cupcake and the hat, um, masked him off and then stamped out the balloon there from the Balloon Bunch Buddies set. And then obviously coloured those with Copic markers and fussy cut those out and added that onto the card just for a really simple birthday card. 
So that was a look at the new release for May 2020 from Clearly Besotted. Links to the products will be in the description bar on YouTube and also over on my blog. I hope you're all doing well. Thank you so much for watching and take care.